Welcome to the IntelliLearn video library, converting infusion rates from mils per hour to micrograms per minute, examples, part one. The order displayed shows that a patient is ordered noradrenaline, four milligrams in 50 mils of 5% glucose to infuse at eight mils per hour. The case notes, which are not displayed on the screen, tell you that the patient's weight is 77 kilograms, but as you will see, this has no bearing on the calculation itself. Rounded to two decimal places, what rate of infusion in micrograms per minute is being delivered? This calculation should be undertaken in a series of steps in order to simplify it. In the first step, calculate the concentration of the noradrenaline additive in the IV fluid. Both of these quantities can be read from the order. The concentration is equal to the amount of noradrenaline divided by the volume of the IV fluid, which is 4 milligrams divided by 50 mils, which gives 0.08 milligrams per mil. This has been expressed in milligrams per mil and should be changed to micrograms per mil because the final result we require is expressed in micrograms per minute rather than milligrams per minute. To do this, multiply by 1000 micrograms per milligram, giving a concentration of noradrenaline in the IV fluid of 80 micrograms per mil. This means that every one mil of IV fluid contains 80 micrograms of noradrenaline. In the second and final step, the rate of the infusion in micrograms per minute can be found by multiplying the concentration of the additive in the IV fluid in micrograms per mil by the infusion rate in mils per hour and then dividing by 60 minutes per hour. This gives 80 micrograms per mil multiplied by 8 mils per hour divided by 60 minutes per hour. To perform this on a calculator, enter 80 multiplied by 8 divided by 60 and then press equals. The calculator will display an answer of 10.666. This answer should be expressed at two decimal places and therefore the final answer is a rate of infusion of 10.67 micrograms per minute.